Hello guys and welcome back to another Move Beach video. This is Jimmy, uh, and I'm gonna be trying to take down Terror today. Uh, sorry I haven't been, uh, um, I didn't get this, uh, uploaded earlier. So, uh, I, I don't know. Today was not a good day. I napped through the whole afternoon and the morning was just groggy to me because I was sore because I, I did, I don't know. It, it was just not a good morning. And, uh, so we're gonna be trying to beat Terror so let's start. Uh, this is a post commentary. So I will be. This is a post commentary. So yeah, uh, I was meaning to get this live, but I kind of forgot to start recording my microphone. And before I realized, it was already Terror Stage Three, which wouldn't have been good. So um, I I failed on trying to take this down with all artillery, but. It only needed one crate down, and I was able to take it out. So, uh, but on to Terror Stage 2. This one I should be able to take out with um, all artillery and barrages. So I'm just going to take out some crates that th triple uh, that triple building and just spam a bunch of barrages on the HQ. I have another one in case it doesn't go down, and it doesn't. So uh, there it is, and it is down. Off to Terror Stage 3. Here we go, yeah, yeah, yeah. I kind of had a fail on Terror Stage 3 because I tried to take all the buildings out and I kind of forgot a boom mine. So that kind of failed. So I'm going to take out this boom cannon and try to get machine gun, but I didn't realize that I didn't take out the machine gun right away. Now I'm going to try to take out this... I, I double barrage and then I'm going to try to take out this sniper tower. The double barrage takes out the things I wanted and the sniper tower needs a barrage on it, so I'm down to 11 energy. It's gonna be 14 if I can take it out. Yes, I do. And that sniper tower, oh my gosh, it's lagging. I'm so sorry about this, guys. So I flare there. Haha, <laughs> I rah. Yeah, I flare there. And then I flare there. Man, I am just, I am killing it today. And. My warriors are still in the smoke, stupid mistake by me, and there's a shock launcher. I don't know what I was thinking on this stage. I lost one due to a cannon, but otherwise everything else was good. I only lost one warrior, and that didn't really affect my next stage or two. Uh, I'm not going to diamond them up, I'm just going to start to retrain, because it doesn't really matter. One warrior for me on ter terror stage, I keep trying to say stare, but one warrior for me on terror stage two, for stage why don't I just end my English career? I cannot pronounce anything. Alright, so, uh, I have 43 warriors. <gasps> I'm missing one. But I don't care, because it's Terror Stage 4, and I don't really need- No, the Shock Launcher got a hold of my troops. So let's fly right to the HQ after this. I'm kind of scared about that move mine, but I'm- I should have been cautious because they just ran right into that boom mine. What about the other one? No! No! I am failing left and right and... Wow, this is going slow. Oh my gosh, I forgot the shock launcher too. Two med kits, not enough. And... Come on. Why? Why did I forget that? Come on. Come on, Jimmy. Come on. Alright, so it's going down pretty easily. It's, I'm going to lose about 13 or so. I don't know. That was just a fail altogether, this stage. It was pretty easy, but yet I just, I blew it, guys. I blew it. I lost 18 warriors. So I'm going to diamond them up, and then I'm going to jump right into terror stage 4, 5, 5. Alright, so I still need a bunch of resources to upgrade that landing craft. And 30 second diamonds. Alright, so terror stage 5, here it is. Looks pretty easy. HQ is not on the edge, so we can save ourselves a couple smoke, which could be handy. Um, make sure. Alright, there's two shock launchers in the back, so I'll be able to kill two birds with one stone on that shock. The shock, the shock launcher. So I'm gonna do the 2 1 1 smoke. <laughs> um, and then I'm just gonna do another flare and smoke to the HQ once they get to that machine gun. And I am gonna wait. Ooh, Tom Brady. <laughs> yeah, I'm cool. Because I get NFL moves. But anyway, um, so I'm going to wait for the um, time, the smoke to wear up. And then I'm going to throw three shock, shock bombs and one med kit. And I'm looking for things to artillery. And it's frozen again. 
All right, that wasted four seconds. Good news, I'm getting, by the time I get back from vacation, I should have the good recording software going on, the Elgato. Uh, vacation is from Friday in about like four days till Friday, which is in 11 days. So in about 11 days, I'll be able to record some good footage. Actually, if I, no, all right, so, I aged, whoa, whoa, shut up, doggy. But uh, I ordered the HDMI cable or the Apple Lightning AV adapter a couple days later, so it will not be here. So I don't think I can record unless it comes, luckily, really early. But they expect it to come in a week, less than a week, a few days. So, oh. I'm so excited to get the Elgato because air server slash reflector is like just killing me with the leg. I was talking to Christian, he said there's some static um, with the Elgato for voice, <coughs> voice wise, but I came up with a brilliant idea and I said, hey Christian, guess what, why don't you just do a separate recording and just sync up the voices? He's like, oh, I never thought of that. And I was like, oh, you're stupid. No, I'm just kidding. Um, make sure you guys check out our habanero pepper challenge where we, it's a two-man operation, and we, uh, we ate a habanero, and then we had to do an attack on Tank Tango, two-man operation, so I failed on mine. It was really spicy. The ice cream and milk helped. Um, I, I didn't react as I thought I would. It was spicy, but I thought I was going to be hiccuping and maybe, like, vomiting a little, but Christian and I never did. And I'm surprised by Christian uh, primarily because he cannot handle spice. He he like he like would choke on a jalapeno, and he did pretty well. And then his brother, uh, there's extra footage, um, and that's on our uh, main channel, Extreme Teens, where we do two day we do uh, two two videos a week of just challenges. And he put extras on that and showed his brother. He started crying legitly, I don't blame him though, because it was really spicy pepper, but he was going all tough, he's like, he was like, where do you bite it? He's like, just bite the whole thing, and we all got countdowns except for him, and he, he kind of, like, he went right for the ice cream. He couldn't, he thought he could get it down without water also, like, it's acceptable to the challenge where you drink water just to get the pepper down. Oh my, warriors are getting, like, half health on this. So hopefully there's no other mines that I hit. Um, oh, I hit a mine. A couple warriors did. But um, Terror Stage 7 here. Can we take it down? I kind of just stopped mid-sentence about the habanero. But this is the moment of truth. Can we beat it for the first time? Because I've never beat it before. So three shocks. All right, so I'm frantically looking for crates and all that to explode. It's about one-third of the health down. Uh, almost a half. About half right now. And my warriors are twinkling down. Everything's getting destroyed. I get it down to about one third health ish, maybe a little more. But anyway, I could not complete it. Anyway, guys, if you enjoyed the video, make sure you guys hit the thumbs up. Make sure you guys subscribed if you haven't already. And um, guess what, guys? Keep on booming. Yeah. Peace out.